what's going on everybody Mr. Sam here and welcome back for another video and today I will be showing you how you can install texture packs texture packs for Minecraft Pocket Edition 0.13 and up or any version you want to do for iOS this is going to be for the latest version and any other version you want to do so basically so get a few things straight first um the first thing I want to say is um, thank you guys so much for watching this. It means a lot and all. And there are not many tutorials on this for texture packs for Minecraft. So I'm going to be making it because I figured it out. It took me a long time to figure it out, but I finally got it. So here's the first few things that you're going to need. The first thing you're going to need is a jailbreak. Now, guys, I cannot explain how many ways you can jailbreak your device. There um, are ways you can do it online. So you're, so the first, if you want to jailbreak, the first thing you're going to want to do is know what your iOS version is. Now, currently, the current version 9.2, 9.2.1 does not have a jailbreak available. Only early version of iOS 9 and below has a jailbreak available. With that being said, you need to know what your jailbreak, your ver, no, not your jailbreak, your your version of iOS is. That's the first thing to do, and then you can go online, look at tutorials and stuff. But anyways, guys, the first thing you're gonna need now, the first thing you're gonna need to have is iFile. That is crucial for this process. You cannot use it. You cannot install texture packs without this. Also, this is gonna be the only thing you're going to need for this now. I have it installed already, but I'm just going to quickly show you just to prove that, uh, whatever. So, if you click on it, here you go, iFile. Um, now, I have this, I purchased this, so I purchased this. It is not free, it's about $4. There's a trial version you can use. Um, you can crack it, but I highly recommend you do not do that because of there's a lot of viruses going around in, uh, city and stuff but i have it bought you can do it there's a there's a free version and a trial version so whatever you want to do that's that's up to you do whatever you want so that's number one you need to have ifile installed and then i've got it right there so then what you're going to want next is you're going to need the link to your texture pack that you want to download so i'm going to go safari i highly recommend you use safari for this i have one by what the heck Okay, I'll, <laughs> I'll look at that later. Okay, so, okay, one of the biggest things is you need a texture pack. I'm going to use this one right here. It belongs to a guy named Pepperoni, or Pepper, I, I don't know, and Italianese 1170, basically, uh, Frankie 2. I can leave, I will leave his channel link and Twitter link in the description below so you can go check him out because this is his texture pack, not mine. So, I already have this downloaded, but basically you just want to download it, so I'll just download it anyway. Hit direct download. Make sure you use Safari for this, because it is probably the best way to do it. So, you want... Now, norm... now, the reason why this pop-up, I have a Safari download or tweak from Cydia. Um, basically, what you do is you'll... I'll just hit download, but normally if you don't have this tweet, yeah, see, it would pop up like this. It says open in or open an I file. This is the way that is the normal way to do it. So basically what you want to do is hit open an I file. That read, okay. Yeah, the, the screen recorder glitches the screen because it's the red bar pulls it down. So don't worry about that. That won't happen to you because you won't, you're not making this tutorial, but so let it, okay. Is it going to pop up or do I need to? Okay, what's it gonna do? You gonna open, buddy? Okay, never mind. Okay, let's try to open it from here. I already have it downloaded, so I can just I can just pull it on up. So basically, where you're gonna find it is that it's gonna do automatically for you, but it's gonna be in var, mobile, and then uh, documents. That's where you're gonna find it. Um, the zip file you need to find the zip file right here. This is my this is a zip file. You need to uh, extract it with unarchiver. I already did, so I don't need to do it. But just click that, and then it'll do it for you. And then you'll get a folder like this. Basically, what you want to do is go inside the folder, go into images, and select everything in here. Literally, select everything like literally select all, and then. You want to hit the copy link. I've already done that, so I'm not, I'm just not, you know, I'll just do it to show you guys. So you can do that. And then what you want to do is I have it bookmarked. Um, the air, or no, wait, no, no, no. <laughs> Step back. Okay. Var mobile, then go to containers, bundle, application, 
in this. Now, you guys may see that there are a bunch of numbers and stuff. What you want to do to enable um, where you can see all the all the names of the apps, what you want to do is you want to hit the settings. You want to go to File Manager and then click Application Names. That will enable it so where you can see the name so you know what you're doing. So that's just a little show you. And then so you want to go Minecraft Pocket Edition. We'll go inside mm -hmm. of here. Oh, I'm... Um, Okay, <laughs> then what you want to do is, okay, I'm turning on do not disturb. <laughs> okay, so then what you want to do is you literally want to go, go to edit, and then hit paste. I already did that, so I'm not going to do it, but just hit paste, and if it says, um, there, you know what, I'll just do it, let's just do it, okay. Yes, the file armor already exists. Do you want to overwrite it or rename it? Just because you have to do this for every file and it's going to repeat itself, hit overwrite all. That will basically do that. That will do everything for you. And now you're done. Basically, now you want to close your app. I'm just going to close all the apps, actually. Okay, except Airshow. <laughs> okay, then what you want to do is then go to Minecraft. And now we can see what we've done. And there we go. We got a texture pack. So, guys, this should work for most texture packs. I do not know. So, why don't we just go into a world right now and uh, try it out. And there you go. You see? Yep. So, you, there's a little GUI change. There, We've got a little different thing. How about that? We got a decent texture pack here. There's much more you can do, guys. You can go explore and all. Um, basically... So, yeah. Okay. So, basically, guys, that's basically it. Um, you need to find your own texture pack. I do not know if every texture pack will work with this. Like, I just don't know. I'm not experienced in the field. I just learned how to do this, and I decided to make a tutorial for y'all. But that's basically it. Um, be sure to leave a like and um, subscribe Subscribe to me. That would mean, that'd mean a lot. And... Yeah, make sure you follow me on Twitter. You can find the link in my channel. And I will and I will see you guys in a future video. See you guys. Bye.